Come on, molasses. I want to see our project while we're still young. I'm coming, I'm coming. Welcome hey, the where'd they put us? I've got the museum map on my phone. Our project's in a special exhibit on the top floor. Can't wait to see our names on the little sign, like real scientists. Today, Oscorp Science Center. Tomorrow, every major museum in the world. possibilities in humanity's ability to explore. You and I gotta get one of these. Bet we could build one out of a vacuum cleaner and some old tires if we put our minds to it. Since the mid-20th century, scientists have envisioned human habitation beneath the sea. Looking out your window, Someday, you might see I'm the naming that one fish, Howard. Or even you name one. Uh, Leviathan. Love it! This dive suit is one of the first developed in the early 18th century. The first pressure-proof diving suit was developed with salvage work in mind. Today's suits such as these are used by salvage workers, scientists, and explorers. Think they'll let me try it on? Would love to see you try to walk around in that thing. Can't be worse than those shoes you wore to the spring dance. Oh, come on. Yours were at least an inch higher than mine. Special exhibits upstairs. There's the elevator. We've got time to look around first. Government and privately owned spacecraft explore our planet, solar system, and galaxy. To communicate with them, Scientists use radio antennas to send and receive messages across local and interstellar space. Oh, I bet the sound quality on these are dope. Not from space. This model proposes a terraforming and housing initiative on Mars, our closest neighbor in the solar system. This community is designed to draw on abundant water and counteract low temperatures, making human life possible on the Red Planet. It's like a whole little community on Mars. Needs coffee shops and street art. Do you have tickets for the special exhibit? Oh, um, our project is on display. Didn't think we needed tickets. You do, and we're sold out. Can't let you go upstairs. Thanks anyway. So we need another way in. She said there's no more tickets. Right, but see that door? The hallway behind it wraps around to the elevator. Can't just break in. We place. have to. You know, They're taking down the exhibit tomorrow, and then we'll never see it. Locked. I recognize that kind of lock. If you shine a light at it, it'll open. The flashlights on our phones will work, but they won't reach. They will if we find a way to slide something reflective under the door. Something reflective. It'd be nice to find something mutable. Mutable? You mean changes shape? Look at you breaking out the fancy vocab. <laughs> Shut up. To play. Oh, come on, it's just button mashing. So you admit defeat? Never. Oh, faster! Come on, Rocket Buddy! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Go, 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 go! Gotcha! Found something I'm better at than you. Not for long. Yes, this game was made for me. 
Two wins does not a master make. Museums like this where I grew up, we had to drive two hours to see something. Architectural innovations are the key to human survival on extraterrestrial planets. We need something reflective. You want a house on Mars? Sure. If I could bring my mics, audio setup, sampler. They won't let you take all that. They will if they want good music on Mars. Not gonna help us get past that door. There was that metal display by the door. Solar energy one with the stickers. We're gonna have to be super sneaky during this part. I'm a master of misdirection. Shape memory alloy. I could change the shape on the museum map. This stuff is crazy. Think it's a meta material? Must be. Wonder if it's using a phononic band cap. That's it. Take it. Don't let anyone see. Got it. Let's go. Whoa, oh, man. Oh. Sorry. All good. Still need something reflective. Look how the external tools interface directly with the command module's computer. We could recreate the idea, but with the neural interface, it would overload our central power. on the back. Perfect for tricking a light-sensitive lock. I've got the light. Tell me when the sticker is pointed at the sensor, and I'll turn it on. No one's looking at us yet. Gotta hurry. Mm, need something else. No? Not quite. We gotta try again. Worked. We did it.
I'm gonna miss doing stuff like this with you. What are you talking about? Uh, hello. You'll be at Brooklyn Visions next week. I won't. I'm not gonna vanish off the planet. We'll still hang out. You'll be busy. Not that busy. I'm gonna make time for us. Seriously. Okay. Ugh, this is getting mushy. Come on, let's head upstairs. Hey, Dad. Hey, Miles. Hi, Mr. Davis. Finn says hi. You kids having fun? Make sure you get a picture of your project. Dad, it's not a big deal. It's totally a big deal. Okay, okay, we'll get a picture. Love you, Dad. Bye. This is it. Our project's in the back. Think they got a converter all hooked up? Otherwise, what's the point? They'll need to feed biomass in, though. Maybe hook it up to a trash can. This engine, used in the Apollo space program, is one of the most powerful inventions that uses the liquid fuel. The most powerful single-nozzle liquid Oswald fuel rocket engine ever made. I'd love to build something like that. Our project. Oh, ho, ho, wee. Would you look at that? Genuine award-winning scientists. No one told us we were in the special exhibit. Ticket only. How'd you get in? Uh, I bought a ticket. How'd you get in? Not important. <laughs> hey, huddle up. We need a picture. You gotta be in it too. You helped us get it working. Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. Scoot over. All right. Say alleles! I am not saying that. Finn, you need to know. I'm done listening to you. <laughs>